We love the fact that you send us these shelfies all the time here on Wake Up Without. Yes, and we've told you what a shelf cloud is, but in this edition of Weather Geek, meteorologist Ari Sassolari is going to talk uh, more about the shelf cloud that we saw over, where was it, uh, Atlantic City we saw a yeah. good one yesterday? Yeah, we've had, we've had a lot of different shelf clouds that we've seen over the last couple of weeks, but I, I'm just going to talk a lot about exactly what creates the shelf cloud. We've actually got pulled a little file video for a really good example of a uh, shelf cloud here. This is actually in Illinois, October 2014. We've got a couple more examples we're going to show you here. But you ever seen these clouds before? They look pretty scary, right? I mean, sometimes these things can just look like a mothership, like an Independence Day, you know what I'm talking about? But uh, there's actually a process going on here that's creating the shelf cloud that I want to show you a little bit about. Look at all this rain back here out behind it. That's usually how it happens. You've got the shelf cloud, and then out behind it, you've got all the rain. And you can actually see these things on radar sometimes, not all the time. If you're close enough to the radar site, you ever seen like this thin little band that's out ahead of the main storm? That's actually a gust front, and that's usually where the shelf cloud is forming along, okay? So here's the process that's actually going on uh, when you see this, okay? So this is a great graphic, by the way. Whoever made this, props to you. Uh, so look at this. you got all your rain down here, right? There's all the rain, and of course the rain, it starts in the top of the cloud. There's a lot of cold air up at the top of the storm, and when the rain falls out of the top of the storm, it brings down a lot of that cool air. So think about it. What happens when you take like a piece of ice and you throw it into boiling water, right? It expands really quickly. That's what's happening with this rain-cooled air. It expands, it hits the ground, and it tries to shoot out ahead of the storm, okay? So it starts to shoot out that way. And then all of a sudden, you've got all this warm, moist air that ends up riding up on top of it. When it does that, it actually ends up condensing, okay? So that's basically all you're seeing here with the shelf cloud. It's just warm, moist air condensing on top of this cool air that's shooting out ahead of the storm. So next time, instead of taking a shelfie, you can take like a warm air condensing on top of cold air e or something e? like that you <laughs> yeah you got to yeah. end that e yeah. that yeah. warm air on top of cold I think, air I think, e i think we're going to st stick with shelfie ari <laughs> yeah. thanks so much and you, you, you the hashtag good. would just be too long that's, that's the problem right.